everyone, it's Tara, and today we're going to talk about five non-musical practice ideas for auditions. These summer months are about preparing for upcoming auditions and working diligently on new music. But while practice is key, non-musical aspects of our audition often go untouched. As we know, many elements go into presenting a great audition beyond the music. Here are a few non-musical ideas to think about while preparing for an audition. Speaking. You may be ready to sing, but are you ready to speak? In many auditions, we don't have the luxury of being introduced. It's up to us. Before you go into the audition, take a moment to speak your introduction, the title of the first piece, and the composer's name. This kind of practice can help reduce audition nerves. You can even entertain a few friends and practice it in front of an audience or use a trusty mirror and say it to yourself. Smile. Smiling is something everyone knows how to do, but may be wise to practice. When we smile, we exude friendliness and confidence, and it's a great chance to let your personality shine through. Smile to a friend, a neighbor, or someone on the subway. If you want to take your smile up a level, you can take a look at the mirror and see what goodness you're putting out into the world. Breathing. Breathing is second nature to us all, and as singers, vital to our art and our sound. The type of breathing that we should practice before our audition is neither the kind that will give us amazing high notes, nor the kind that will perfect our runs, but rather the kind that will calm us down. If you need some ideas on how to breathe mindfully before your audition, check out some yoga breathing exercises. These can help calm you down and get you ready to walk through the door. Entering the room. Walking into a room seems like a very easy task, and you probably don't need to practice walking unless you are getting used to a new pair of shoes. But taking some time to find your pre-audition headspace by collecting your focus before walking in can change your whole demeanor. Confidence. The best way to be confident is to know your music inside and out when you walk into an audition. This means not only practicing your pieces, but also knowing what to offer. If you are not ready to perform something, nerves can get the better of you. However, if you take the time to practice and learn every aspect of your music, you will have been practicing your confidence the whole time. Passion. Sometimes, practicing our passion for music can be as simple as taking a step back and remembering what we love about music. When we work so hard for our art, it's easy to lose sight of why we do what we do. If you need a break, watch a new version of an opera that you are working on or learn something new about the composer. The passion that we have for our music is what drives us to sing and reminds us why we love our art. Find a way to bring this passion into every audition and show each listener why you love to get up each day and sing. Every person has different ways of practicing and preparing for an audition, and these are just a few ideas to add to your routine. If you have other suggestions on non-musical practice ideas, share them in the comments below. We hope this information helps you build a career and have fun doing it. Please like the video and subscribe to our YouTube channel so we can continue making videos to help you. If you have any questions about this video or other topics, leave them in the comments below.